It's time for the ultimate build challenge, Melon. Today, we're going to be making alphabet lore letter N. Let's do this, man. I'm going to destroy you, dude. I've been working on my building skills. Bro, we both know you're an absolute noob, and I'm a professional. So I just want to let you know you got up to 15 minutes to work on your build. I probably will only need 10 because I'm the goat, bro. <laughs> Jump on your side. Let's go. Okay, buddy. And the timer starts right now. Yo. Oh, my melon details 3D. That's actually sick. I'm literally looking at the sun, dude. My side looks clean. So I'm gonna start with dirt to create my schematic. Now I'm creating the arch of the F. Go down a little bit, create the second art. That looks pretty good if I do say so myself. And this looks like a good game plan. Now I know how to build my letter F. Just gotta make it three dimensional and with black wool because it's more realistic. Oh, this thing's gonna have to be big if I want to build all these rooms. Okay, guys, while Melon's working on his stupid build, I've got a trick up my sleeve. So check this out. If I type schematic list, look at all these options. And one of them says F schematic. So I'm gonna load this beautiful build in. And all I have to do is type paste. And when I hit the enter button on my keyboard, I will be the best builder ever. Oh, please. Spawn in the right place. It'd be really awkward if it destroyed the wall. This is looking pretty good, guys. This is looking pretty dang good. Oh, it feels good to be a professional builder. All in a day's work. Man, I really had to put in blood, sweat, and tears to make this letter F. Now, the question is, where do I want to make my entrance and my first trap for Melon? I think I'm going to dig out his eyeballs. Boop, 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 ba -doop. And I'm going to even do this. Check it out. I'm going to take some melon blocks and I'm going to go like this. He won't be able to resist it like that. Oh, that's beautiful. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some fake lava and hold on to it for later because I don't actually need that right now. What I do need, though, is ghost blocks. And I'm going to go like bloop, 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 bloop. And let melon solve the first puzzle in my build, which is flying through F's eyeball. Yes, we're inside. But it's so dark, man. I got to light this place up. It's Get some shroom light blocks. Ah, uh, yeah, that's looking good. Comment down below what you think my first trap should be in this build. Now I've created the pole for the F. You know what I'm talking about? That little line that goes straight up and down. Yeah, this part, this part right here. This is a better way of explaining. This is that. You get it? You get it? It's pretty good, right? Check this out. This is coming along really nice. Now check out my beautiful creation. Is this not the most beautiful, most realistic letter F you've ever seen? So once Melon enters the letter F, the first room trap that I went with is gonna be pick a door. Door number one or door number two. Now Melon will have to choose carefully because one of these is gonna be deadly and the other will be safe. Well, actually that's the thing. Neither of these is gonna be safe. They're both gonna kill him. So I'm gonna put a lever here. And behind the lever, let's go back out here. There's gonna be this TNT and this TNT and this TNT. And then I'm gonna put these annoying ones at the bottom. That's pretty good. Go back inside, cover this up with the stone. And now I need to grab myself some signage to say, congrats, you won. Pull the lever for 64 dollars Diamond. That's totally believable, right? And then in the other door, what I'm gonna do is turn this block that I'm standing on into a ghost block so that he falls straight down. And what I'm gonna place down here, it's also gonna kill him. It's gonna be a dispenser with a pressure plate. I gotta be careful not to kill myself with this. And I gotta just build this up so he has to fall down perfectly. Now he has to touch this. And what's gonna come out of the dispenser is one mutant. Huh, do we want a zombie? zombie, a skeleton, a creeper. I think the creeper is probably going to be the funniest. And then we put that egg right there. Beautiful. Now that my trap is set up in my first room, I'm going to go see what Melon's up to. First thing I'm going to do is fly over the wall. And look at this little Melon down there. Oh, this build is so cute. That's a nice looking F actually. I'll give him some credit. And as long as he doesn't look this way, I'm going to put a security camera right there. And another one over here. Perfect. And now I just have to register these cameras on my monitor. There's one and the other one right here. Boom! Now when I check this, I can see exactly what Melon's up to. That is goaded. And now guys, I don't want to push my luck, so I'm going to go back to my side. And we can either use these security cameras to spy on him or... 
I can just break through the wall and take a quick peek at what he's up to. As long as he doesn't look back here, we're good. All right, guys, it's time to start creating some rooms. But first, let's make the door. Passcode 69. You guys already know. Save that. Guys, I just snooped on Melon putting his secret code on his door. Now I could sneak in his letter F so easily. Now I enter the passcode 69 and boom, it opens up and then you enter my bill. But first, I got to add some extra security measures. Guys, that was close. He almost saw me. Grab some of these real quick. What extra security measures is he doing? Dude, he's putting down explosives. Let's put this one inside just in case. Okay, I don't want to go through that door. That is going to explode in my face if I open it. Claymores around here. I know this looks stupid, guys, but look. He's gonna think all these claymores are outside, and when he goes in and types the password, boom, he's gonna get exploded. <gasps> Guys, that was close. He almost saw me again, but at least now I know what he's up to. He's booby trapped his letter F's entrance with claymores and landmines. He's rigged it to explode. So, guys, this whole letter F eyeball melon is a troll. I'm actually gonna make the real task inside of his teeth. So, let's open this up. Come on in. And we're gonna need more light again. It's so dark in here. Let's do glowstone this time. Light this baby up. Oh, yeah, that's better. I can see everything. Now, what I wanna do is set up a little course where he's gotta complete parkour, kill mobs, and complete puzzles in order to progress through the letter F. So, let's flatten out the floor. This is the start of the letter F. F challenge. So Melon's gonna come here and he's gonna have to complete all my challenges. This is gonna really confuse Melon because the first thing is gonna be a fake lava trap. Let's put this all down. Oh no, it's spreading. I didn't mean to do this. Uh, uh, wait, it's actually stopped, so we're good. So he's gonna have to hype himself up to swim through this lava because he'll probably think it's gonna kill him. And once he makes it through the lava, he'll go down this staircase into this room. And I'm gonna set the floor to be real lava. So Melon's gonna have to complete some parkour to get across to the other side. The only thing is, some of these jumps are not gonna be real. They're actually gonna be ghost blocks. And another ghost block right there. Perfect. Melon's gonna be so confused. And once he makes it across, I'm gonna give him a reward. One trap chest. I don't actually want this trap chest to be deadly. I just want it to scare Melon. So what it's gonna do is spit out a cobblestone house TNT. This is perfect. It's just gonna freak Melon out. And then in his newfound house, we want to set up another challenge. He's gonna get mutant skeleton armor and a netherite sword. And as soon as he picks that up, I'm gonna spawn some mobs on him in this tiny little room. All right, guys, I've been putting in the work. Check out this. So you walk in, right? You see this ladder, you climb up to the second floor, and then boom, there's a dirt maze. Sonny's gonna start walking around thinking everything leads to a dead end. And then eventually when he sees this ladder, comes over here, he's gonna think, oh, he found his way out. But then boom, he falls through a ghost block and now he's in this parkour area. So in order to escape, he has to do this parkour, climb up this ladder, and he's still gonna be so confused. But then there's an even deeper secret. He has to walk through here, walk through that ghost block, and come up this ladder. And now this is the stage I'm working on right now i'm working on a chest trap i grab some tnt bada boom he'll never see a thing coming now i'm gonna add this item frame with an ender pearl in it and sunny's gonna need this later in the course if he wants to make it to the next level now check this out after melon's been destroyed wearing his mutant skeleton armor i'm gonna send him here for another challenge he's gonna have to rescue the melons <laughs> look at this little smiley face i made i'm gonna imprison a very powerful creature here the most powerful creature of all he's gonna have to face himself a mutant skeleton Actually, three of them. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, Melon gonna die. He's gonna die big time. Melon, how's your build coming along? Bro, whatever you do, don't look, but it's pretty sweet. I bet you it's better than yours. 360! I didn't see anything. We're good. Good. You better not have seen anything, because it's top secret. Yeah, well, you only have five minutes left to finish your build, bro. So make sure you put in those finishing touches and make it a banger. Oh my god, I got five minutes left. I gotta go. I gotta go. Time's running out. Let's do this. Guys, I only have five minutes left to work on my epic build. So what I'm gonna do in this big room here is uh, I'm gonna make another parkour course, but this time it's gonna be literally impossible, and it's gonna make Melon rage super hard. So check this out. 
I need to choose some blocks, and I think I'm gonna go with sponges. I don't know why, guys. I just kind of feel like building with sponges. So once he comes through these security doors, it's gonna be an easy jump, three block jump, simple jump, another easy jump, and then after that, it's gonna pretty much get impossible. So like, check this out. It's gonna be a little ladder jump where he's gonna have to do like this. He's gonna have to grab the ladder there. Then he's gonna have to do one of these where he climbs up the pillar to the top. And then after he gets here, oh wait, He's gonna be squished into the ceiling. Let me fix that. There you go, he's unsquished. He's gonna be doing a head bumper jump, which is my least favorite in the game. So yeah, let's make it toxic. And go like this and good luck head bumping that. Make it a little easier because I know these are pretty dang hard. And then we'll go like this, one more head bumper. And what I'm gonna also do, which is hilarious, is I'm gonna remove the entire floor. That's what's gonna make this super tilting. And now I've removed the entire floor. So if he misses a single <laughs> jump, he's gonna fall to his death. And if he survives these head bumping jumps, I'm gonna make something really weird down here. Check this out. And if Melon makes it all the way here, he's gonna then get met with a slime jump. And then he'll have to stick the landing. It's about somewhere around here. Oh yeah, that's actually pretty easy. And I don't want it to be too hard because I want him to feel good. I want to boost his morale, give him confidence just so that I can take it away after. And then let's make some easy stuff here. Like he's just going to run across this path. There'll be like a little jump there, big deal. Another little jump here. So now Melon's had a couple of easy jumps. I'm going to do something weird here. Okay, so what I'm doing here is setting up some boosts booby traps that are gonna destroy melons. So I just need to install my paintings. There's one, there's two, and the last painting right here. So when Melon gets here, he's gonna have to pick a painting to go through and two of them are gonna lead him to his death. There's nothing he can do but fall and die. And then the other one is gonna have barrier blocks. He's not even gonna realize this one is safe until he goes through it. And now I've gotta build the treasure room. It's gonna be made of gold. Okay, guys, let's quickly spy on Melon and see what he's up to. He's still working on his letter F, but there's less than two minutes remaining. I've got something I gotta do to him, though. Check this out, guys. Dynamite. Which one do I want to use? I don't want to be too much of a jerk, so I think just five times dynamite's pretty good. Yo, Melon, what up? Yo, what up, Sonny? Wait, what are you doing? Nothing. Sonny, what are you doing to my build? Nothing, dude. Bro, what is wrong with you? Get out of here. Why is there a hole in the wall? It was just a prank, bro. Bro, what the heck? Closing it. I'm closing it. Now I gotta repair my ladder. Now that this room is completed, what you're gonna notice is this gigantic painting right here. And if you jump, it's really annoying. But boom, you can find this exit right here. Now you found the secret exit. Climb up this ladder and Sonny will have his very own full netherite armor plus a wooden sword. Why does he have such strong armor and such a weak weapon? Well, because I wanted to troll him. Now when he jumps up here, this room is going to be filled with bees. Just going to spam these right now. And he's going to have to find the one ghost block in this room to escape, which is going to be right there. And now he falls down into this epic lava room. Each one of these diamond blocks is gonna have a skeleton, and he's gonna have to ender pearl through a single hole that I will create in a second. I created the treasure room, and there's just one last thing to do. I gotta come over here and spawn a bunch of fake ghost blocks. That way, when Melon makes it here, He's just gonna fall to his death over and over and over and he won't understand why. And then he's gonna yell and rage and then he'll read these signs and it will all make sense. <laughs> <laughs> the never-ending loop of letter F trolls. Because uh, right here, guys, is barrier blocks. It's impossible to get through. Literally not possible. Melon, there's only 30 seconds left. No, wait, chill out, chill out. All my bees have escaped too. Oh my God, this is a disaster. <laughs> what do you mean all your bees, bro? Uh, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. 20 seconds. Oh my God, I don't have much time left. Okay, I gotta make his prize. Here, put this in, some dirt and some flint and steel. Now hopefully Sunny detonates this TNT because even if he's in creative mode, this TNT still will kill him. There's only 10 seconds. Nine, Chill. eight, seven, six, five, Congratulations. four, three, Detonate. two, 
One. Two, three, four. I'm busting through this wall. Prize, let's go. I just finished. Let's go. I'm at your base, dude. Yo, your letter F actually looks really cool. Thank you, dude. I put a lot of time and effort into this, and it was extremely difficult. He's kind of cute. You like his teeth? You like his eyes? He's looking through my soul right now. And you know what he sees? He sees this melon. What is this? Camera monitor? Bro, have you been spying on my base this whole time? Not this whole time, but I took a couple of previews. What is wrong with you? You're such a troll and a cheat, Sonny. Whatever, bro. I'm ready to check out your build. So, Sonny, you're gonna walk through this totally non-booby trap door? Yeah, you got it, bro! No, no! <laughs> you think I'm gonna fall for that? And you're panicked, because you know it'll blow your whole build up. Yeah, you're supposed to walk around it, okay? Gotta go around real careful. <gasps> I feel like if I take one wrong step, everything's gonna go kaboom! Don't do it. Like this. Kaboom! No, Sonny, Sonny, stop. Sonny, kaboom! stop, please. Please stop. Go back, go back. Okay, chill, bro. Ch Dude, don't step on your own minds. Okay, what is this door here? Keypad door. Well, I think I know this code. <laughs> 169. Wait, how'd you guess it? Bro, come on. That's the goaded number. What is this, bro? You build a dirt maze? Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait, wait Why do you see have that, a ladder? Yo! <laughs> <laughs> you got trolled, bro. You got played. I thought you were really small brain at first and then forgot to block out your admin ladder. Nah, dude, I'm just a genius. I'm actually a big brain. I'm a parkour master, though, so this is nothing for me. Okay, that parkour was a little bit easier than I expected. Oh, wait, now I'm back up into the maze. It's that same ladder. Interesting, bro. And I see another ladder over here. How do I get to it? Your dirty maze. Wait, I'm an idiot. It's the same one. <laughs> no way you fell for it again. <laughs> You're kidding. Let's go. Hold on, hold on. Where's the real way out? I don't know, bro. Just look around. All right, ignore the ladders. Ignoring the ladder. Just gonna keep ignoring your ladders. But this one goes down. This is the one that tricked me. Wait a second. What if I just jump through? No, it's actually barriers. <laughs> oh. Bro, Sonny, how did you fall for that three times? I didn't fall for it the third time. I'm trying to figure- No! You weren't supposed to figure that out, Sonny. But where am I now? I'm confused. Oh, I can get to the ladder for real. Are you sure you want to go on that ladder? Yes. I'm progressing. Let's go. What do you have in here? Give me this ender pearl. Um, you've got a karate master and a chest with pressure plates, Melon. Yeah, you should maybe step on those pressure plates, maybe. You think so? What if I just take the chest for free? You got nothing in it! You think I care? You've upset me! I'm running! No, you exploded my beautiful creation and revealed the secret passage! Let's go! What a trash chest, bro. You gave me nothing. But where do I go? I don't trust your ladders anymore, Melon. I'm gonna shift, because I don't believe you. Climb the ladder. Bro, you gave me full netherite? Give me this. Oh, I look good. But then you only gave me this trash wood sword? What the heck, bro? Yo, get these bees out of my face. Let's go. Yo, you messed up, Sonny. What are you talking about? I'm an absolute unit. I have netherite. I'm slaughtering them. Oh my God, Sonny, you're actually dead. You're actually dead. What are you talking about? I'm so strong. Oh my God, they're whittling me down. They're actually poisoning me. I need to eat my steak. Let me eat my filet mignon. Bro, what have you done? My eardrums. You know what? Please, forgive me. Please, forgive me. Ow. Please, please, be chill. Yes, they're going back to normal. No, they're not. Never mind. They have blue eyes, but they're still angry. They're not angry anymore. And I almost died. I'm at half a heart. Wait, you survived on half a heart? Yeah. I won't attack these bees. I won't attack these bees again. Melon, what the heck am I supposed to do in this room? We got bees coming from everywhere. But where are the bees coming from, Sonny? I don't know. They're literally coming from this giant crater you made when the TNT exploded. Sonny, look at the bees. Look what they're doing. I'm trying to help you here. They're literally dying. They're suffocating in a wall. <gasps> Ellen, I'm in your ghost block. What does this sign say? Find the ghost block. Well, I found it. I'm on it. Dude, there's another ghost block, Sonny. Somewhere hidden in this room. Oh my gosh. The room is huge. Wait, these bees, what are they doing? No, why are they showing you? <laughs> They're my friends. Let's go. Come on. I'm through. I'm at F's teeth. This man needs some dental work. <laughs> Wait, dude, that... That was not supposed to happen. Just go in the hole. Follow me. 
Should I trust you? I mean, I actually have nowhere else to go. It's that or I die. So let's do this. Oh, yo, what? Oh, get across, get across. No way you survived. You were supposed to die there. That was terrifying. Good thing I had this netherite armor to protect me though. Dude, you put three skeletons to kill me. Oh my God, bro. Why did you shift? You were supposed to not shift and get launched off. It's because I'm goaded, bro. Plus I had this E-Pearl from earlier. I could have probably gotten back up. Where do I go? There's just a hole in this wall. Yeah, just a hole. What is this? Hey, hey, no, 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 no. Get me up. No. Wait, I can think, I can do this. I can big brain this and close the door. Jump. Yes. This is going to be close. Two hearts. I'm healing. Yes. Sonny, you weren't, oh, this is way off script, dude. I thought you were going to throw it through the hole, but you just wasted your pearl and died. Well, sometimes that's the way it be. I'm living life on the edge. What is this one saying? Congratulations, detonate TNT for prize. What do you mean, TNT? Oh. Wait, you can reach it from there? Yes, I can. <laughs> Yo, Melon, you want some hungry TNT? Wait, wait, Sonny, Sonny. We can talk about this. You don't have to detonate this TNT, all right? But Just I'm chill. hungry! No! no! It's eating me alive! Let her F chill! Chill! Oh my god, what is happening? I'm dead. I'm getting eaten. I'm getting sucked. Bruh. Wait, I'm actually surviving. Let's go. Oh <laughs> my god, it killed me. It even killed me in creative mode. Melon, it's time to check out my letter F. Take a look at this beauty. Dude, there's no way you actually built that. You spawned that in 100%. Dude, I had 15 minutes to build. I was thinking about adding the rest of the alphabet, but I stuck with just letter F. Okay, buddy. Okay, like I believe that. Now the rules of my build challenge is that you can use creative mode to fly around when we need to change areas, but that's it. Otherwise, you're in survival mode. So for the first challenge, where do you think you should go? I see some Malones. I think I'm gonna fly right into them. Yo! Yo! I knew one of those was a ghost block. All right, you solved the first puzzle. Good job, bro. Now what are you gonna do? So I can just fly around. Instead, I can use creative mode to fly. No, only to access the challenges. Fine, I'll go in survival. Now, I can pick one door. One door will kill you. One door is safe. Blue is always good. Let's go! You probably thought I was gonna pick red, right? Because red is my color. But I'm switching the script. Bye, Melon. Oh my god. No! Dude, I can't believe I picked the wrong door. Well, at least I know this door is safe now. <laughs> what is that? Safe? You think you're safe? Wait, this mutant creeper isn't hitting me. Uh oh, no, no, no. Let me out. Sonny, you are such a troll. Why are both the doors killing me? Yeah, I got bad news for you. Neither of these is safe because this isn't even where my letter F challenge starts. This whole thing was a troll. Oh my God, Sonny, what is wrong with you? Follow me this way. I'll bring you to the no, starting line. Creative. <laughs> Bro, you splattered like a pancake. Okay, Melon. It's over here. This is the actual start to the challenge. Oh. Yeah, yeah. you're giving letter F a cavity. Go in his tooth. Start of the letter F challenge. See? I told you. Okay, well, first of all, let me throw this door in the flames. Good idea. Now, let me figure this out. Hmm, if I was using my 3000 big brain IQ of the melon, I would say this is fake lava and I can run through. Okay, good job. Good job. You solved one mystery. Dang, dude, that was easy peasy. Yo, melon, this is fake lava too. You could probably just swim straight across. I don't know. No, why, Sonny? <laughs> Yo, what up, Ellen? Oh, you're such a troll. Okay, well, now I know it's not fake lava, so I just gotta do this. <laughs> no! Yes! You bumped me. I didn't do anything to you, bro. What are you talking about? Yeah, you so messed me up, bro. You, All right, I'm, so look, I'll, I'll be far away from you. Jump, jump. Whoa, that was easy, Sonny. You made that too easy. Dang bro. it. Now I got a chest. Let's go. Look what you missed, Melon. It was oh supposed to be God. this. <laughs> It didn't blow me up. It just spawned a house. <laughs> nice one. Yo, what's in this house? Dude, there's gotta be some other secret around here somewhere. Is there like some ghost box or Oh my! <laughs> nice. Let's go. You're actually crushing my challenges so far. Good for you. Sonny, I don't like that there's a dispenser right here. Well, that's what made your stone house, dude. So chill. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing to see here. Bro, this armor looks epic though. Give me this. Give me this. Give me all this epic armor. Not a bit. Wait, wait why did I place that down? <laughs> 
Dude, your helmet. You almost lost it. Put that on. Don't place it down. Then I got my netherite sword. Let's go. I'm ready to slay some foos. Bruh, what am I supposed to do now? Just look right behind you, dude. Dude, this was not here a second ago. I am an artiste, bro. I whipped it up quick for you. You know what? I'm not gonna question it. Let's go. Dude, what am I supposed to do now? Oh, give me this. And I gotta save the watermelons. Good luck, bro. Bucket clutch. Wait, what? Oh my god. Oh my god. Sonny, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, Sonny. Mutant skeletons versus mutant skeleton. Oh, you lost. Bro, I stood no chance. They're so strong. And your melons are dead on the ground. No. I'm sorry, melons, but there's no way I can save you. They're just too strong. Oh my god. <laughs> you can abandon your melons, but the challenge isn't over yet, melon. Wait, keypad door. Bet you I know the password. No way it's not 69. You want a hint? What is it? It might be 69, but there's one extra number in there that doesn't change anything. 420. That's a big number, bro. Ow! Oh, you're getting owned! What is he doing? Yo, he's slugging you. I am dead. How did he get up here? Die! Die! Oh my god, Sonny. Sonny, they're too strong. He's destroying you with his bow. There's two of them up here. No, they're invading. What's the passcode? 069. It's still just 69. I'm out of here. Oh, oh. Well, now you just have some peaceful parkour to complete. Okay, this is going to be easy enough. And by peaceful, I mean if you slip and fall, you fall to your death. It's okay. I don't mess these kind of things up, Sonny. All right. Oh, oh, oh. oh my God. Yeah, you don't mess these kinds of things up, Melon. Ah. I don't, Sonny. Now, hit him. With a one, two. No! <laughs> you hit the ceiling. You fell for it. No, no. I gotta get out of here. Sonny, I'm in a corner. I'll no, open the door. door. <laughs> I'll keep the door open for you, bro. Hurry up. They keep whacking me. <laughs> bro. You're getting destroyed. No, no. They just hit me back down. <laughs> What is going on? I'm dead again. <laughs> if only you were goaded. <laughs> I killed the skellies for you. They're gone. Thank you. Thank you. You got this, melon. No! <laughs> oh, it's good to see you struggle. Bro, my parkour is too hard for you. Are you kidding me? <laughs> melon. It's okay. I got it this time. With speed, with pace, and grace, swiftly fall into the void. I'm in go mode. I'm doing it. I have three choices. All right. I'm going to start with the left one first. Yeah, nice one. No! Melon, I can read your mind. You always think it's the one on the left, bro, but not this time. Right. It's the one on the right. No! <laughs> it was dead center. The most obvious answer. Dude, you outthink the thing thing thinking. Thinking. Yeah, you out -thunk. Yeah, it's not out. It's not. What? Nice one, bro. It's not hard to out -thunk a melon. Going in, and I'm staying in these golden blocks. Dude, you did it. No. You beat the game. Let's go. Actually, though. No. Nice. <laughs> another um... trap. Another L. There's got to be a way I can get around this. Are these all ghost blocks? No, they all are. <laughs> I could watch this all day. Bro, how do I win? What do I do? Just read the sign, bro. Oh my god. I wrote you a story. Congrats, you win. Here's your reward. 99,999 melon. Diamonds. Infinite gold. Goaded armor. 1,000... ID points for your small brain. IQ points. Yep, I knew that. <laughs> A never-ending loop of trolls. Bro, is there no way to win this? Uh, there is one way out. Here you go, buddy. You threw it in the ghost block. All right, dude. I'll give it to you again. I can do this. If you concentrate and focus hard enough, you can escape this trap. Let's go. It did nothing, Sonny. It didn't do a thing. Congratulations, you won! No! You're such a troll. You didn't give me anything. I taught you a valuable life lesson. You don't always get what you want. I got kicked. And sometimes they kick you while you're down. Two life lessons. <sighs> well, whatever, Sonny. I guess you win. You trolled the heck out of me. Dude, your melon cap, it fell off. Dude, I got stressed out from all the trolling and I went bald. Oh, wait, it's back for me. Don't forget to like and subscribe, everybody. And click the next video on screen for more goaded videos. <laughs>